Okay, in today's video I'm making a speeder pad holder for the FL Sun V400. It was like two other designs that I found and I combined them and I just wanted to show like how simple it is to combine two different files using Blender. So this is how the item, you know, this is how it looked once it printed out. Unfortunately I didn't get a time lapse, but I'll show now how I... I'm just going to show how I combined the two items in Blender. It's pretty simple. You just want to select everything and delete it. And then go to File and Import the objects that you want to add together. Okay, so you see now both have loaded in. All I did was grab this bottom one. If you haven't used Blender before, you just use G and that will grab the object. And then you've got to pick what axis you want. So if you say Z... It's going to lift the height of it. And then I press R. And then you can press X. You just want to line that up roughly. And now look around it. R, X. Tilt it back a bit more. And then G and Z to lift it up a little bit. You just basically want to move it around like that until you get it in the spot that you want. Once you got it to where you want it, and you can see there, they're not sticking through, but they're intersecting all the parts, so that's sticking through a little bit, but that would be fine. If not, you could always rotate it a little bit and just get it off. So now you just select them both, right click, and say join. And there you go. Now that's one piece. Now you would just say file, export. And export it as what you want. STL. I did mine. Oh, also I forgot to mention I put up, I put this up on Thingiverse. So if anyone wants to STL, mine is actually a bit different to this one. I might upload this one as well. Actually, I'm going to save this one. I'll upload this to the same file, so there'll be the choice of this one or the other one. So again, thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll put out another video as soon as possible. Thank you.